<laughs> so I think when people see Dina, they automatically assume, oh, this is perfect for Beyonce, she's a singer as well. So for you, was it really challenging role? It was, because Dina is so different for me. I, for the first time, was able to play a character um, that had range and that completely transformed. You know, she starts out so plain and uh, naive and young and she, she butterflies into this diva that is like a tortured soul and is, you know, lonely really. And even though she's dressed up and there's pain behind her eyes. So I had to do a lot of work to make sure, you know, I transformed and I lost 20 pounds and I did a lot of work with my acting coach for six months. Um, and the hardest thing for me was not holding back vocally. I knew that I would have to do that as written in the script. Um, or even not wearing the makeup in the beginning, the thick eyebrows. It was controlling my actions because, you know, Laurel was so funny and so cute and charming and, and bubbly and um, Effie was so over the top and she was a diva and very strong. And Dina was so controlled and focused. And, um, you know, even when someone said something really powerful to, powerful to her, she responded so, everything was so subtle. And that was really difficult because I didn't have a lot of lines. I had to do a lot with my face in a really subtle way, which took a lot of work. Could you at all personally relate? Because you just said Dina's a very subtle person. Mm -hmm. and I would think being in your position, oftentimes you're asked stuff and you probably have to hold back. Like you can't give what you mm -hmm. really want to say maybe mm -hmm. or whatever. Um, I guess so, but we were two different people, um, I, especially on the stage because, you know, I let I asked the director and the producer to come see my, my um, practice when with Destiny's Child, mm -hmm. we were doing our last tour and we were rehearsing and it scared them because I'm far from subtle on the stage and, and vocally I'm not subtle and there's nothing really about me that is. So it, w it was, it was, they were scared that I couldn't, it wasn't believable for me to be young Dina and I had to do a screen test and, and show them that, you know, that is closer to, to my personality and reality. Working against Oscar winner Jamie Foxx, what did he teach you or did he bring, you know, what did he bring to the table? He was like a big brother to all of us. Um, he was just a good person and so sweet and would say anything to break the ice and keep, keep, keep everyone laughing on the set. And um, I was nervous because, you know, I knew I, my hardest scenes were with him. So I, I felt a little silly after I had been around him being so nervous because he's just so normal and um, would give suggestions and compliment everyone on their scenes. Just a, I couldn't have asked for a better person to do my, my scenes with. Um, also, you know, when he needed, when I needed to be more angry, he would ad lib and say crazy things to me to get me more worked up. And he just was very supportive. All right, Beyonce, thanks Thank for you. your time.